After meeting with more than 8,000 parents, students, teachers, and community members, the Guilford County Schools Superintendent says she's taken what she's heard and she's putting it into action. Now tonight, Dr. Whitney Oakley announced the district's new strategic direction. Fox 8's Caroline Boyer joins us here in the studio with a breakdown of what's included. Michael, Katie, there are four areas district leaders will focus on. The first is accelerating learning, then recruiting, retaining, and rewarding top talent, strengthening health, wellness, and safety in schools, and lastly, preparing students for the world. Dr. Oakley says there's a lot of work ahead, but she believes addressing these issues will benefit the entire county. Our new strategic direction is not just GCS's strategic direction or the superintendent's strategic direction. It's the strategic direction of our community because public education belongs to all of us. Superintendent Dr. Whitney Oakley shared with parents, staff members, and students her plan to move Guilford County Schools forward. Hundreds of people sat in the Stephen Tanger Center for the Performing Arts in downtown Greensboro Tuesday night. I thought it was very well planned out. Um, it included just about everything that we needed. The first part of the plan is to make sure students get back up to grade level post pandemic. We cannot address learning recovery and transform learning outcomes for students without our people. That's why part of Dr. Oakley's direction includes giving staff livable wages and creating an environment where they feel appreciated. Many educators in the crowd agreed. I think historically that's been important, but it's time to do something really significant about it. Another investment is in technology. Over the next year, GCS will add 5,000 cameras and put Evolve touchless scanners in all 21 middle schools across the district to make campuses safer. I have also experienced my daughters having that scare um, and it shakes you up. So I think that is a very important um, idea. District leaders will put $15 million toward mental health resources over the next five years and expand telehealth options. All of these pieces will benefit the end goal, making students successful. North Carolina is the number one in business, but we must prepare our students to compete in a global economy. Dr. Oakley ended her presentation with a call to action. We need your help to make Guilford County Schools the best place to learn, work, and grow. And a song from Southwest Middle and High School choral students showcasing the power of standing together. Strong schools make strong communities. We can do it together. There are several construction projects underway to create better physical learning environments for students and staff. Dr. Oakley says she wants these new schools to be places where students can explore various career paths, making sure they have all the tools needed to get jobs upon graduation. Michael. Nice to hear her getting such a good reception on it. Caroline, thank you.